Hello everyone, you are welcome to New Face Entertainment where you will get reliable and authentic news that will keep you informed and entertained. I say a very big thank you to everyone who has been part of this channel and who has taken time to subscribe and if you are here to subscribe, please click the red subscribe button and also hit the bell icon for notifications so you will always get alerted anytime we publish latest news or any of our other uploads. Hello beautiful people, welcome back to New Phase Entertainment. Chairman of Afnafir Renewal Group, Chief Olawe Oshun has described Minister of Justice and Attorney General of the Federation, Abubakar Malami's statement that a regional security outfit, a Motakan, is illegal as rubbish. Chief Oshun said Malami should also declare his Spakor, a religious police force responsible for the enforcement of Sharia, and civilian joint task force in the Northeast illegal. He is talking errant nonsense. Let him declare his the police in the 10 northern states illegal and also let him declare the civilian joint task force in the northeast. He is talking rubbish, errant nonsense. Those are not Nigerian police institutions and they are not Nigerian security institutions but they were created because there is a need, a motakun was created because there is a need for it. He is talking nonsense, Chief Oshun said. The former chief whip of the House of Representatives urged the governors of the Southwest to go ahead with the implementation of the Amotakan. That is what the people of the region want. The governors must go ahead. This country belongs to all of us. They must go ahead, he said. Leader of the Yoruba World Congress, Professor Banji Akinpo, said Malami's statement shows one thing very conclusively that the people controlling federal government do not have the welfare of the people southwest at heart and we will look at that and decide what we want to do. Akinpo, a renowned historian, the northerners have created many society-controlled organizations in the north. They went to create Sharia policemen that can arrest anybody. We, in the South, never question that, nobody in Nigeria questioned that. What we have set up is not another police force. We have not set up anything that conflicts with what the Constitution provides for and so, we are in a good condition to defend our interests now, that all. The Yoruba people must be ready to defend their interest under the law, he said. He told the Southwest governors to the bull by the horn. This does not mean a confrontation with the federal government. Lead us now, and we will follow you. Can a man elected by a people from X states refuse to defend his people when they are under pressure? The answer is no. The governors have a job to do and we look forward to them to do it and as they do it, they are assured of our supports, he said.